slow motion. And Kyle, as a not much of a dirt racer myself, he looks really loose to me, and I know they're all going to be sideways, but it looked like that truck had a little bit more skew in it than the rest. Yeah, he was definitely loose there through, uh, I think that was one and two. Actually picked the left front up off the ground, which was something that you know, I have yet to see since Blundquist came here the first year. So um, interesting there, but uh, he'll have some work to do come heat race time. Hoffman's qualifying time fourth quickest today, 21.39. Vince, this is a driver and a team that had a lot of work to do after practice last night. He was involved in a crash down in turn four, knocked the whole front end of that truck. Oh, and the back end. And now the back end's gone. Wendell Chavis, he's a dirt racer from Georgia and was really looking forward to this opportunity. And the team had a lot of work to do today to get ready. And uh, darn, got away from him. Looks like he got a little tight there on entry and, and picked the gas up. Just a little nervous there at the steering wheel. It kind of got the car or the truck unbalanced there and, and snapped around on, on exit. Quite a bit of damage there. Now this team will be able to repair that truck, I think, and, and start that qualifying race. In fact, heck, let's just go ahead and finish this qualifying there for what do you say? Doesn't hurt to get a lap in here. You he may, he may be able to beat a couple guys here uh, by the end of practice. Remember, the top 27 in speed would be locked in automatically for the race tonight. Wendell hung with it. Going to get a lap in, like you said. And Chavis ends up fifth quickest at a 21.97. Check this out, Kyle. This is what you're looking for. That's a dirt shot right there, right? We were buried <laughs> in the cushion and uh, left front off the ground. So that'll, uh, that'd make a good hero card. I love it. That, that to me, Vince, that describes Eldora. That's why we come here to watch and, and why we love it so much. Well, and Nick Hoffman is one that, uh, hey, what, he 